Hi, my name is Donna O'Rourke, and I'm making this video to introduce myself to you. Let you figure out if you want to even follow me, see my journey. I'm talking to the individuals who live with chronic pain, day in and day out, who suffer, who most individuals don't believe that they're in pain because they look okay. They don't have a broken bone, you know. Um, see, when you live with chronic pain, especially with uh, a chronic illness that is uncurable, your life, most of the time it's just going to doctors after doctors and hospitals and medicine and pharmacy and it's just this roller coaster of blood work and being told, ah, oh, your blood work comes back fine. We don't know what's wrong with you. You must be okay. But you know you're not. You, you can tell your body hurts, your muscle, your joints. The days that my bones hurt, I, those are the days I can't get out of bed. When I stand up to walk, I look like I'm about 80 or 90 years old. It takes a while. Once I start going, hmm, I'm pretty good. Going up and down stairs, uh, forget it, you know. But I, I, I figured out in my life just different things that have helped me with my chronic pain. Um, I will tell you one thing that doesn't help, not exercising. <laughs> See, I've been a fitness instructor for a really long time. And my husband used to tell me after I would teach a class and I could barely move afterwards. And he'd say, this class is hurting you. Teaching is wrong. It's, it's, it's just hurting your body. You need to stop. And after a while, because I was in so much pain, I agreed. Um, I did have to have my fourth heart surgery and I had a hysterectomy and I'm really bad with anesthesia. So the four years that I took off, um, it was hard during those four years, but I'm ready to get back because the pain didn't disappear because I stopped teaching. It actually increased and now I'm overweight and in pain. So not a good combination, but what this time around, I'm going to focus on, it's, it's going to be more along the lines of movement and meditation. When I taught my dance fitness class, and oh, don't worry, I'll still be making routines. I just got to move slowly, get my body back into a condition that when I dance, I'm going to be able to teach you those slow, sexy moves. Yeah, you'll enjoy. But right now, we're going to focus on the mindfulness, the meditation, the movements that are slow and gentle. Getting the body back in balance. If you'd like to join me on this journey, if, if this speaks to you as, yes, I'm that person, I live in chronic pain, I can barely move, oh, I can't exercise, oh, it hurts or it does this, I'm here to help. I want to be an example of what you can do with chronic pain, not what you can't. We all have a lot of limitations that's put on us because of our pain and our illness. But let's take control of our mind. See, we can breathe in and slowly breathe out. And as you learn to slow down and enjoy your life, enjoy each moment you're going to notice that the pain can be less and you can enjoy your life more. I hope you take this journey with me. Please push like, share, 
and join me on my journey to recovery. Looking forward to talking to you soon. Bye.